You're not supposed to be a woman support like that. They don't appreciate it. It's true. Oh, who said that? It's true. Okay. I'm red. I'm red pill. Listen, listen. Don't get me wrong. I'm red pill, meaning I know the truth. Women don't like us. <laughs> it's it's hard, but hey, <clears throat> it's a hard world. Yeah, it's a hard world, but you know, <clears throat> yeah. In short, the kindest way I can say it. Okay, for instance, watch this. Love. It's not what the fairy tale book says. No. Exactly. Right. Okay. Now. We don't kiss a frog and they don't turn to Prince Charming. Thank you. It's a real world out there. It doesn't mean that being awake means you bitter and you hate women. No. Just know that, you know, and this whole, for instance, Women don't love men, men. Women don't love me. They love what I can do to them, what I can do for them, what I can offer them. It's, it's sad, it's hard, eh? It's just, yeah. but you I've know, but it, you know, it, it it's gay, okay? But, yeah. you know, men right because in society we have been programmed that men are protectors and providers um unfortunately what you're saying is harsh and it's not going to be true to everybody but there's a lot of truth to it yeah i mean um, no i'm listening oh, oh yeah <laughs> i thought you were going to say something yeah. <laughs> um yeah but then it also goes back to like I think as you just get older too, like everyone just values you for what you can do for them. It's not like even women go through that as well, but men go through it more. Yeah. And it may not just be money. It may... Okay, we're both adults. Some women like you because of your friends, your social status. Some women like you because the way they, because the way you, because the way I make them feel about themselves, but they don't like me. Okay. Women don't like men for them. Mm -hmm. And that's the like part, them. right. That's the part that hurts because, okay, I, I can't be your Mr. Bojangles forever. Meaning, I can't, I can't, I, I'm not, I can't, I, okay, yeah, I can't you make you, at your lowest too. right, I can't, uh, your girl is not going to love you like your mom. No, <laughs> Do you see what I'm saying? But you got to understand. Right. Well, hey, you know what? Meaning, I, I got to understand that. I got to take that. I got to just, all right, yeah, and. Keep moving, which makes it hard because by just opening up my mind and realizing this, this is the kicker. Uh -huh. We've been together for a long time. I've been spoiling her. You when your man oh, loves you, Jackie, oh my God, you're gorgeous. Oh, you tell a man to do something, he going to do it. You hear what I'm getting at? Yeah. Okay, there we go. There we go. I just painted the picture, right? So my girl, when she said, hey, Ronnie, she called me Dada. Just give me a minute. Hey, Dada, give me something. Dada, I need a, something about that tone and her voice that whatever. And women have it. Women know it. Like, like y'all y'all, think we're some kind of genie. But, and it works, right? One girl said a long time ago, she go, you know something? They may be players or whatever you want to call it, whatever. That man will pull the sun down for you. Aww. But I'm saying, but it's true. 
You see what I'm saying? It may take a, it may take forever in a day, but I'll do it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, you understand what I'm saying, right? But then it gets to a point in the relationship where you got to be like, okay, hold on. Pump the brakes, right? See, I learned one, one of them said this, right? And forgive me if I'm scattering around a little bit because I know we press for time, but I'm going somewhere with this, right? The thing is, right? It's like, so you can't let someone else be responsible for your happiness. Yeah. That in itself takes a type of mental maturity to understand and get that, right? Like, whoa, right? And a lot of girls, a lot of women grow up thinking that, you know what? This guy is going to make me happy. That's the first mistake. Right? When you go on dates with your girlfriends, what? You got you guys got a whole big old list. Never even met the guy before. And you already got a list. Like, what the hell? Like, <laughs> but I'm saying, right? Basically, nobody can fill that list. Right. <laughs> So, the, to get back to it, like what she's going through and how is that affecting you? Yeah, like. You're used to that, like you've been the type of boyfriend or husband or whatever you want to call yourself right. to her. Yeah. That always give her and, and provide something and, and, you know, all this. But right. Now it's like, do you feel like what she's going through now is something you can't really help her with? Right, right, exactly. And not only that, I can't help her with it. It's one of those situations where if I do help her with it, it's got to come from her. Yeah, of course. Thank you. Yeah. She's not. What is she doing for herself? Right. Well, well, she's going to. Okay, I'll give it. Hey, she's going to the to the doctors herself. She's going. She's going. You know? Yeah. And it made me look at bad behavior in a different light. Right? Like, like, people do what works for them. Of course. Right. So, 